Welcome to part 7. I have how to make a Japanese shoji screen. In this part I'll show how the Kameko material is prepared. This was an added part because I realised that I had not included a section on how the material for the Kameko was prepared. This first dimension to 8mm and that is the critical dimension because of the joining where the two pieces are joined an 8mm router bit is used to cut the joint and therefore this material must be 8mm or as close as possible to it therefore I use an 8mm slot that's been previously cut in a piece of material to check that I'm getting 8mm 8mm material through the thickness of it. and then I'll adjust it I'll adjust the thickness to give me that 8 millimetres. Here I'm checking for the grain. It must be done, it must plane with the grain, not against it. So running your finger along the, along the material will tell you which way the grain is going. It helps some time to wet your finger and it makes it even easier. I'm double checking here to ensure that I'm, I am getting an 8 millimetre. It doesn't matter so much if it's a little bit above 8, material, 8 millimetres, but it mustn't be below. If necessary, you can sand down to the 8mm if, as you're fitting the joints if they're not exactly 8mm. In this section, you'll see the material is now being ripped slightly oversized. It has to be 10mm in the other direction, so the final dimensions of the Kamiko is 10mm by 8mm. The 10mm is not at all critical though. More than one piece can be run through the thickness at once. As you'll see here, I do three. With more than three, it's a bit difficult to catch them as they come out. And now the final two can be fed through. Once again, I'm checking to make sure that the brain direction is going the right way. I do initially check them before I put them on the table saw, ready to pass through the thickness of that. I still check every now and again to make sure that I've read the grain the right way. Some pieces can be tricky, grain can be a little bit mixed, it's difficult to tell sometimes in exactly the right way. And that completes it, thanks for watching.